Look at him. Look at his little face. He's so evil though. Hi guys, it's Shroomy and welcome back to a new series on my channel. This is so exciting. I know I keep starting new stuff, but it's because change is good. And in my survey that I did the other week, uh, it was a few weeks ago now, um, it was kind of a 50-50 divide by people who liked um, legacies and people who liked challenges. So I was like, I will make both, bo both, both, <laughs> I will make both of you happy. So t today we are going to be starting the Disney Princess Legacy Challenge, which you probably will have seen around, like, floating around the Sims YouTube area. But we are going to be starting that today, and I'm so, 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 so excited um, because I absolutely love Disney. Like, Disney anything is so cute, and yes. <laughs> um, the Pike Legacy will still be happening. The way it's going to work is, like, every other Tuesday is going to be each one of these. So this week it is Disney Legacy. Next week, Pike Legacy. You get me? It's going to be every other week to keep both of you happy, and that way I don't get as bored of the series as, as quickly, so it's great. Um, but anyway, that is enough with me waffling on. I will briefly introduce you to my sim. This is Snow. Um, obviously, if you don't know how the series works, I did have up the rules. I think it's basically you have your founder, and um, should I get up the rules? I think I should. Hang on. I'll be, I'll be right back getting up the... Uh, di Disney. Oh, hang on. I can't spell Disney. Disney Princess Challenge Sims 4. Uh, yep, here we go. So I think you can still hear me. I will put this over on my other screen so that we can read it. Uh, just check that I'm still recording because that's always a fear of mine. Uh, I'll just cover up my screen. Right, and I'm back. <laughs> Um, yep, yeah, I'm here. Uh, so, the generation one is Snow White, and it says, I'm wishing for the one I love to find me today. Um, the founders have humble beginnings, so what's better than Snow White? To start, create Snow White. Storytellers may create her as a teenager and make her her evil stepmother, but this is not a requirement. I haven't, I've just jumped in with her as a young adult. Uh, so, my sim must be female. They must have seven children, which I like to represent the dwarfs. Um, each child must have a bad trait, for example, gloomy. Each child must have the same baby daddy. And each child must complete their aspiration and or get an A at school. Um, and Snow may never answer the door to strangers or talk to elderly women. So, that is the rules if you're not familiar with this challenge. So, this is the house. I just quickly like whipped up this Judah cottage because I was like... I feel like she probably would live in the woods, but it's kind of hard for like her meeting people and stuff. So this is her house. Um, sorry, I'm getting notifications off Origin. Um, but yes, so this is the house. Should I do a house tour? Yeah, that's fun, isn't it? Oh, get me. Um, and put the walls up and we'll go into tab mode, which as you probably know, or if you're new, tab mode is like hell for me because I'm terrible at it. So here's our little kitchen. I kind of made it like 70s with the tiles and stuff. I don't know. Um, it's not the cutest, but obviously we will renovate the house over time. I'm not sure what I'm going to do as her source of money, but we'll have to find that out. Um, I know the lights aren't very in keeping with the whole Tudor thing, but I was like, it gets rewired, it's fine. Uh, so it's got a fireplace, a uh, sofa, and also these curtains size down perfectly if you've updated your games. I'm recording this a week before, two weeks before it goes up because I have a thing at the weekend which means I won't be able to record any videos. So yeah, just a little living room uh, here. Uh, through here is a room that we will use for children at some point, but because we don't have any, I've just put a computer in here. Uh, no biggie, and I hope I'm not making you feel seasick. Not seasick, because we're not on the sea. Uh, sim sick. <laughs> so, yeah, so here is her bedroom, which is just this. It's The whole house is kind of manky, but we will fix it. Um, I said this vid in a video before, but manky, if you're not familiar with it, it's just kind of British slang for gross. Uh, but yeah. So this is their bathroom, and it's fine. Uh, and that is basically the house. We haven't, I haven't done much on the outside of the building because we don't really have the money. Uh, but I'm not sure, it doesn't say in the rules that she can't have a job. So I don't know whether I want her to have a job or not. I feel like she probably wouldn't. But how else are we gonna earn money? I'm not sure about that. Uh. I don't know if I want her to have a job or not, like a proper job. Hang on, let's have a look at the jobs uh, category and see what we can make her. Cause I kind of want to do a get to work job because I feel like that would be more fun. 
I can imagine her being a doctor, you know, because she, like, loves people, but then... Hang on. I might have to find some way of, like, integrating this into her thing. Uh, detective, doctor, astronaut, athlete. Hmm. I feel like... Oh, she could be a writer. That's fun. Uh... Hmm. Oh, she could be, like, a... Hmm. Detective? Uh... I like the idea of her being a doctor. We can always change it, but I think it'll be fun. And also it gives us something to do. So when she's at work, we're not just like stood here. Uh, but for now, I think we should go and explore around the town. I don't play in Winda Win Windap <laughs> Windenberg that often. Uh, I don't know why. I probably should, as it is very European. Um, some of the buildings are kind of ugly, but should we go? Oh, she can't talk to strangers. No. Oh, she can't answer the door to strangers. We can talk to strangers. Uh, oh, he's a teen. Should we go and cheer this guy up? Right, let's go friendly introduction. We're still on the hunt for our baby daddy, so. You know, Marcus, he might be the one. But, I mean, he just looks a bit sad at the moment. I mean, come on, mate, it'll be all right. <laughs> um, so, Snow is going to go give him a friendly introduction, and we will hopefully hit it off. Uh, she's quite a friendly person, so hopefully she will be nice to him and cheer him up i'm not a fan of his top you know but that'll be all right discuss sad mood um also it didn't tell me in the rules what her uh aspiration and traits had to be so i did big happy family because she's gonna have the dwarfs and stuff um yep so she's gonna have that and then her traits i did her as a music lover because in the film she likes to sing so i was like okay she can have like a singing thing on the side um she's family orientated and she loves the outdoors so that's what i made her i just kind of thought about what her character might be and then um was like that sounds like a good plan <laughs> um so we're gonna just talk to marcus for a bit and then what's the time it's like sunday morning oh this is all so adorable uh visit the cafe oh that would be so adorable right sorry i think i've just said adorable like twice in the same sentence um but yeah i think i'm gonna have to film the next episode after this maybe i'm not sure because of the whole like upload thing i don't know but i have some exciting stuff in the running for december so get excited for that um yeah i've been planning it out i feel very mysterious <laughs> but yeah so we're at south square coffee Ooh, right oh who's this guy he oh right oh he looks really nice he's like Meh. <laughs> um friendly introduction we're just going to talk to everyone because i feel like she needs to just get to know some people around the town so that we can um you know just uh is there a tend i don't want to tend uh there is already a barista oh we should probably stop talking to the barista that's not a great idea um and then we can hopefully order some food can i hang on i just want a... all right is he gonna go and barist that's not a verb but oh my god he's dancing well i mean whatever floats your boat mate are you not gonna dance again have i put you off oh that's a shame did you see that when he stood oh yeah back again Woo! oh i probably shouldn't be doing that he's just like i'm just singing about coffee singing about coffee great um okay that's awkward but i mean this is me whenever i go out for coffee uh i'm just like yeah that's just oh i see i can't do the tab mode yeah let's just go out for coffee in the most extra outfit we own uh yeah oh is this the barista all right okay so hopefully we'll be able to get an actual coffee now um because stop it stop it Lu louise lamb <laughs> <Bleh. laughs> oh my god i amuse myself so much louise sounds like a nice girl we can be friends to, with her i mean with the last name lamb what else can we say <laughs> so i mean <laughs> she sounds like a great person uh but ask about her career uh heartfelt compliment hopefully louise is someone we get on with discuss favorite band i mean boast about family uh enthuse about new albums it keeps giving us romantic options oh look all the people are flocking to us 
Now, this is what I call popular right here. They're just like, thank you very much. <laughs> right, hang on. BRB. Hi, I'm back. Sorry about that. I always have a bad habit of stopping halfway through, but I'm back. And where were we? Oh yeah, we were having our mass like party here. Um, but I really want a coffee and she won't tend. <laughs> oh right, she's tending. Uh, but this is kind of a flop okay uh i want to go what is this guy doing well i i mean he has just stood here looking very angry in a cowboy hat a turtleneck jumper and some green trousers so i mean <laughs> wouldn't you but yeah we're gonna go here i kind of need to earn some money but i don't know how <laughs> Oh yeah, we've got a job. Sorry, I forgot that we got a job. Right, let's go home and we did a bit of socialising, but I think we're going to go home and maybe do some cooking because I think we need to work on our cooking skill and possibly find a new baby daddy, but not yet. We might go out tonight. I'm not sure how long the other episode was. I think I recorded for about seven, eight minutes and I've been going for a minute now, so I think we're on about 10. I don't know. My ma I know that isn't the correct maths. In case you're wondering, Shrimi, your maths is terrible. No, my maths is fine. Um, but yeah, it's very autumnal out my window at the moment. Like all of the trees are orange and I'm like, yes then. Um, right, we are back home, back in our humble abode. Right, um, I think I should auto lights, but I kind of like having the lights on even though our bills are going to cost a fortune. Uh, how's she feeling? Let's get her to just go to the loo and then practice her cooking skill. Um, cook mac and cheese, uh, party size. I do want to get up her cook- oh I haven't done lot traits. Well I'll be done. <laughs> um, should we just do, uh, hmm, I want to do, is this the one that improves cooking? No. Bracing breezes? That's exercise. Chef's kitchen. Uh, hmm. I want to do that. And then I kind of want to do that on ley line because it's fun. And I know twins are going to ruin our life, but <laughs> why not? Uh, yeah, so let's going to get her to go. Oh my god, she can't get past. I knew that, was, that wasn't going to work. The game was like, oh no, it'll be fine. I'm like, no, no it will not, because she can't actually get through her house now. <laughs> so that's fun. Uh, yes, so we're all good in the Snow White household. Uh, let's just finish that up and hopefully she will, yeah, she can walk past that now. And we are going to make some mac and cheese uh, and get up her cooking skill, hopefully. Uh, but is her cooking skill going up? I have absolutely no idea. Oh yeah, it is. Okay cooking skill is going up. That is fine. Uh, yes. So, who do we want our baby daddy to be? That is the real question. I kind of want one of, like, the OG sims. Um, so not just, like, some random townie. I want it to be some, like, cool, not cool, but, like, some recognisable townie. Oh my god, is this, like, a subway? Is it? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> um, but yeah, should I go into map? Hang on, let's go save and manage worlds because I haven't saved yet. And that's kind of bad if I haven't saved my game. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you're excited for this series and I hope the people that like challenges are happy. And if you don't like challenges and you're watching this just because it's a shroomy video, remember, the legacy is still here, but this is a challenge. So yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I can't help looking out the window at those orange leaves. They just look very aesthetically pleasing. But Oh, it's like the entire hedge has gone green. Right, so who do we want to uh, be our baby daddy? I don't want it to be someone who's going to die, though, straight away. Uh, so if I go into Willow Creek, this is where most of the OGs live. Uh, I don't really want to do the pancakes. Hmm. Could we do Mortimer? But then all of our kids are going to have terrible genes. None of the townies are good looking. That is my issue. So, hmm. I don't know. If we go to Oasis Springs, will there be any better ones? Probably not. Uh, the land grabs. Um, should we just do John Johnny Zest for the lols? Uh, I'm kind of tempted. 
Or Langrap. Jeffrey. Do we want Jeffrey? I don't know. This is a hard decision. Right. We will. What we'll do is we'll go to Windenburg. Actually, why did I just click on Windenburg? Right. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> We're going to go to Willow Creek and we are going to go to the. Hmm, go to the nightclub with snow. Uh. And we are going to, hang on, I'll do some like random thing, okay? Um, and we will pick our man. Um, so this is exciting, isn't it? Woo, choosing our man. Well, I, I kind of want them to have good genes. Is that bad that I want them to have good genes? <laughs> it's just because this is a 10 generation legacy challenge. Uh, Nancy, I feel like this might be faint. Faint? Fate. Oh, who's the bartender? They're all women. I mean, he's the first man to turn up. Uh, I think it might have to be Don. I mean, why wouldn't you want this? And look at him. Look at his little face. He's so evil, though. <laughs> well, he's not evil. I feel like because he's the first guy to turn up, we probably should. Okay. Right, let's just make our move and see how it goes. And then we will go. It will we'll see we'll go from there. See how it goes. Well, I know I think I know he's single. I mean his jeans aren't the worst. Uh he's not exactly cute. I don't really want to break up Bjorn's family. That's that's my only issue. He's got kids and stuff and then we have to look after his kids and then it's just bad. Also, why are all of these people coming to the nightclub in the middle of the day? We're only here to pick up a man. That's the only reason we're here. Um, yeah, they're all women. <laughs> so, considering he is pretty much the only guy apart from Bjorn on the lot right now, uh, I feel like it's fate. <laughs> uh, let's just see, do all of these actions and see if our friendship with him goes up at all. Um, otherwise, we'll have to give him a miss. But I feel like it'd be funny, unless we go with... Marco? Also, can I just address the elephant in the room? I do not have cats and dogs, and I am suffering with pretty much a massive amount of FOMO from the fact that everyone else has cats and dogs, and I'm seeing all the screenshots and all the people getting pets, and yeah, I am suffering a little bit, but we'll be alright, we'll be fine, uh, but yeah, I haven't got cats and dogs, I'm getting it for Christmas, hopefully, um, but yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna get it for Christmas if I can, uh, but yeah, we, I don't know if that's gonna happen. I don't know. Uh, let's give him a flirt. Let's just see how the flirt goes and then we will make our decision as to whether we are going to, you know, get with Don. I mean, has he got an earring? Is that what that was? Oh, 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 oh. Well then. <laughs> Uh, let's just do a pickup line and then I think I'm gonna have to end the episode so um, yeah <laughs> oh hang on how's it gonna go is it gonna be well received oh yes then get hers no come on she's like yes then thank you very much uh, she's like side-eyeing that girl she's like help pillar <laughs> Like, what have I got myself into? This is terrible. Um, yeah, but I think I'm going to have to end the episode now. Um, if you've enjoyed the first episode of this series, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. Be part of the Shroomy family if you are not already. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to pre-film the one after this, so I will have to make my decision. But, bye guys! <laughs>